No ring. What are we gonna do? Calm down, Richie. No gloves. No rules. Just big jugs. Continuum. No, I'd come and open that one. Yes, please. Just my legs haven't rehearsed this bit. <laughs> I don't want to let you in. Come on. <laughs> oh God, my.
that's just the ladies and gentlemen. A little extension I've had made. Oh. How'd you do? <laughs> God, I haven't ever. Yes. Oh, how embarrassing. Oh, this? Yeah. Oh, no, don't worry about this. I've just been down the police station having my new photo fit picture oh. done. <laughs> Apparently, my last one's completely unrecognisable oh. now. What do they want you for? Uh, stealing. Oh. Yeah, I've been stealing again. Burglarising right, left and centre. <laughs> that reminds me, I've, uh, I've uh, sorted that TV for you. You've what? I've sorted, sorted uh, that TV. What do you mean sorted? What does sorted mean? Oh, don't you understand snatch speak? What do you mean sorted? That's snatch speak, sorted. Oh. It means I burglarised a TV for oh. you. But obviously I can't uh, let you have it just yet. Why, has it got to cool off in a lock-up till the heat's off? Oh, you're remarkably oy vey with the underworld parlance. Oh, yeah, I've sniffed crack. <laughs> Pilfering lot. I know, know, I know, but my lud, I don't blame me. I blame me mummy and me daddy. I blame bad education and poor street lighting and bad oral hygiene and nits. Mainly I blame Posh and Bex. <laughs> because they lit the blue touch paper of my envy. Still, I've had my comeuppance. Have I? you how? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Because when I needed the police's help, they completely forsooken me. What do you mean, forsooken you? Well, last week, you know, I had my handbag nicked. Saw who did it, know where they live, told the police, and they refused to act upon it. Well, who did it? Aliens did it! Oh. <laughs> Not again. Yeah, last Tuesday. Came down to get a few more of my Philippine eggs. You what? My eggs! My eggs! Oh, have they got enough of those by now? They must have 50 million of your eggs by now. Yes, but apparently 50 million isn't enough to spawn a whole new universe of me clones. Well, why you? Why well, I you? said that to them. I said, aliens, why me, for heaven's sakes? You won't believe the answer. <laughs> Apparently, I am the essence of all that is perfect in human womanhood. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently my eggs are top quality. Oh, so I'm whisked off to another galaxy, aren't I? Mm -hmm. I'm manhandled onto a surgical gurney, legs akimbo. <laughs> and they begin the brutal exploratory probing through my pants. Do you know what they do what? to distract you from the pain? What? They show you some telly on the ceiling. Do they? Yeah. What do they show you? Oh, smash adverts mostly. Oh, <laughs> oh they love those. They love them. They think they're documentaries. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'll tell you what they showed as well. Oh, what's that programme I love? Um, oh, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Oh, I hate that show. I hate that I show. I hate that show. I hate that award-winning Chris Cocking Talents, don't you? Yeah. I hate him. Who's the only millionaire on that show? I Chris Cocking Talent, that's who. <laughs> but I worked out why. I worked out. I think he's got the answers written on that card. No. He says he sits there and he, he makes me squirm. Dawn French. <laughs> Your question for ten pounds in coins. <laughs> what is the capital of England? Is it A London? B somewhere else? C, somewhere else entirely. Or D, a worm. Ooh, I'm squirming. Come um, on, I'm gonna have can I phone a friend? Phone a friend. Well, pick it up then. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Which is it? I have no Oh, idea. she doesn't know, she's oh. too thick. Um, can I have 50 50, please? Taken two away. Uh, well, how am I supposed to get Come on, I'm gonna have to hurry up. Can I please ask the audience? Yes, ask the audience. Right, audience, which is it? London or a worm? They don't know. They don't know that. Right, thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, okay. Um, I'm plumping now. Mm -hmm. I'm plumping for D, a worm. Is that your final answer? Yes. Confident. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Are you any 
doubts, any insecurities, tense, nervous headache, mental health problems. <laughs> I adopted, accident at work, need compensation. Come on! Are you an alien? Yeah, of course I'm not an alien. I'd have green dealy boppers on if I was, wouldn't I? And they only speak in beeps, beeps, beeps. Anyway, anyway. There I am, on the surgical gurney, strapped down, helpless, legs akimbo. And they begin the egg hoovering procedure. <laughs> Oh, God. You know, probing all my privates with the microfiber cameras. Oh, on the end of their long, E.T. waxy fingernails. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes. And they're sucking out all my bodily fluids. <laughs> oh, and they cover me in bulldog clips. That's unnecessary. That's unnecessary. And do you know what they do then? What? This is disgusting. Mm -hmm. Do you know what they do? Mm -hmm. They rummage through your handbag. How <laughs> Commercial art. Me. Ah! 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 Not open. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to French and Saunders in 2000. The show that we're going to present to you tonight is going to be quite different. It's going to be a show with more maturity. Gone are the days of the old slapstick. The silly turban, as you can see, is... <laughs> already gone. In fact, this can all go. Can you get rid of this? That's all old, old French and Saunders stuff. We don't want that. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, the show you'll see maybe a little bit harder, possibly, to laugh at. Because tonight we're going to be present presenting presenting our our concept show, comedy as art. Taken a, lot of, <laughs> taken a lot of our inspiration from our, uh, I normally like the from our visit to the Tate Modern. <laughs> this evening, ladies and gentlemen, stop it! Oh. Excuse me, bear with me. What are you doing down there? What? What are you doing? Don't look at me directly. <laughs> I'm undercover. What? I'm blending with the audience. You're supposed to be up here doing the mic! Right, I'm going to have to explain it to you. Meet you downstage left, right. <laughs> put something on to entertain the ladies and gentlemen. Oh, go on, I think I've put on. I'm professional. We'll put this on. Put this on. This, this, this. What? What? This, this, this. Oh, quickly, kidding. quickly. <clears throat> what? what? Oh, this better be good. Jen, 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 Jen. Good. Jen, Jen. Don't look like oh. me. I've had some very shocking news. What? Apparently there's some illegal cocoa substances, also known as chocolate, in the audience tonight. 
Now, I have been sent by the Chocolate Bureau of Investigation to go into the audience and brutal out the evil perpetrators of the crime. That's why I've got this pinhole camera. Why, every time we try and do something a little bit more mature, you reduce it to this pathetic juvenilia. Stop looking straight at me! Now, listen to me. I want to do comedy as art just as much as you do. That's my dream as well. But this is for the government, Jennifer. Oh, don't be so stupid. This entire building is surrounded by the chocolate police. There are no chocolate police! Right! You've reduced me to having to show you this. I can't believe you. What is it? Just cynic. Read it out. Dawn French. Damn. Top agent with the Chocolate Bureau of Investigation. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> How can I help you, officer? Thank you for that respect, young lady. Now. What I need you to do is be my decoy, OK? I don't want to go into that jungle with those choco scumbags for longer than a minute, OK? Mm -hmm. So when I give you the code, which is go, bitch, go... <laughs> you will do something extremely physical to distract them. Jim, bring on the pole. Now then. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes, yes. No, I do that in the privacy of my own home. I am not going to do that. <laughs> Jennifer. This is for the kids of Bristol. You will do it. Now then, I'm going in. OK, yeah. let's synchromesh watches. I've got 50, 40, 82. Yeah, 50, 40, 82. OK, I'm going in. <clears throat> Cover me. Don't be too long. Bear with us. I don't think they know I'm amongst the them. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, that looks like a user. There. <laughs> Any, uh, Got any stuff, love? Got any gear? Got anything? Come on, I'm desperate. Got under here? Got anything under here? Got anything? Come back, let me see in there. Let me see in there. Got anything in there? I need whirlies, I need teasers, anything. I'm in desperate trouble. Come on, I'm injecting Bourneville, melted Bourneville. That'd be all right. Okay, anything along here? Anybody help me with anything? You got any Belgian? Nothing like that. Oh, I see something. Pass it along, pass it along, pass it along. Quickly, pass it along. <laughs> I've got a little bit of stash, a little bit of stash here. Oh, yes. Oh, that's very good. Thank you very much. <laughs> very good. Okay. Oh, uh, hang on. Very good. No, whole packet. Thank you. Oh, yes. Yes. Very well. Yes. yes. Very good. There's a lot of serious users in Bristol. <laughs> oh, my God. I've seen the big mama. Get prepared. Hi, babe. Hi. I've seen you on the streets, haven't I? <laughs> Fair being sir, aren't you? You got any purple I can have? Go. Come on, let me have it. Oh, yes. yes. Stash, the big chocolate mama. What are you talking about? <laughs> don't do this. What? Don't. <laughs> Jen, Ooh, don't do we this. Said we said you were in the audience. The building was surrounded by the chocolate. Any more of this juvenile stuff? And look at you. <laughs> this is beneath <laughs> you. You've lowered yourself you to this. Bitch. You have tainted this sacred stage. I can't you did look this. at this. How unprofessional is that? <laughs> can't believe you. Get off. Very, very disappointed in you. Very sad. <laughs> Sorry, it really isn't who we are anymore. That's much. Bam! What I love is the resolution and the expressiveness of the paint in the intimately, densely unfinished areas of self-aware abstraction. Oh! And without a pause. Oh! And the transparency of the act. Oh. Her walls seem to vomit plaster. The surfaces of white light illuminating the self-contained sublime atmospheres. And we are shown the metamorphosis, the oh, yin, the yang, earth, all man and woman. An underlying polymorphous life suggesting dynamic life systems, an embellishment, a filigree, a conceptual trope. Standing for this oh, utopian impulse, this academic post-minimalism. Oh. 
spun out of decorator madness, inspired by embryonic images of cell phone. Patriotism, depicted by a lengthy, fleshy, Shut it, you wankers! A lengthy, fleshy, pink phallus approaching an anal-like starburst of pod shapes. Do you mind if we have a drink out here? Thanks, just such a lovely day. I don't want to be inside. Thanks very much. Cheers. <sighs> Half an hour late. <sighs> Thing. I've got a splitting headache. Oh, sorry to hear that. Well, you could have postponed this, if you like. Done it another time. Well, this is my time. This is the only time I have. Well, you are half an hour late. Can I just stop and get some cash? Oh. You know, slow those bloody machines up. Press a button, then wait. Press a button, then wait. Take your card, wait for your cash. There must be a more efficient way of getting money, isn't there? <laughs> Do you um, want something to eat? Uh, no, I'm not eating. Not eating. Oh, well, I've ordered a sandwich. I have yours. That's fine. <laughs> You, oh. my Jesus, text, 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 text message. Have you got text? No. You've got to get text. It's fantastic. Yeah. Tiny little messages to save you all the bother ringing. Oh, shit, this is my decorators. Can you believe it? They've been two years in that bloody house. They still can't find the right white paint for the hallway. Oh. Do you mind if I do this? No, no, do. I don't want to do that because I keep coming back to the... Oh, I meant to tell you that um, Nick and Rosie have split wrong letters up. going in. Why is that? What a bloody hell. I hate that thing. Could Jesus you call Christ, where's my organiser? I'll just make a note in my organiser and a list to ring... Bring the painters. Oh, shit. Shit. Sorry. Shit, light fittings. Damn, I was supposed to put some light fittings up on the way here and I couldn't. Ah, I'd been much later. I'd never have made it. Why? Where did you have to get to? Paris. I'd never have made it. <laughs> well, this morning? Yeah, mad, no. mad. Not with the traffic the way no. it is. God, I tell you, doing up a house is a never ending hell. But your house looks lovely, Obi. Well, you don't know anything. It's not finished. You're just like John. He's happy to sit around in all the old crap. I'm not aware of the stress and the pressure that I am under to get the whole thing finished. Sometimes I think I'm servicing a life that someone else is living, you know. It never gets done, no. It's like hand over hand over hand over hand. It's like death. The second you're born, you're already starting to die, you see. It's ridiculous. And look at this, look at this. Where am I in all this? Lists, 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 lists. Some of these lists going back years. Abby, I mean, you don't have to have lists. You haven't got one of these, have you? No. So you don't know. You have a smaller life. Mine is a roller coaster. But why is it such a roller coaster? You haven't worked for ten years. Cross this off, can I? Get well card for Tony. He died last year, didn't he? Yes, yes Abby. We yes. went to the funeral. Do you oh, remember? Oh, shit, I could cross this lunch off. Oh, when we had the lunch, I'll cross the lunch off. Can um, I look at that? Oh, you look at it, don't yeah. you? Okay, now, let's just cross everything off just for a minute and freeze. Can you give that back to me, please? I want to talk to you. Can you give it, will you give it back, back to me, please? Have split up. Will you give it back to me now? You know what you're doing? You're going to wait for me! Right. God. You think just taking it away is going to make it all stop? Oh no. Husband, kids, house, car. Husband, kids, house, car. It's never ending. Sometimes I like to take my whole life and just, just push it back behind two big doors, you know, and lock them. And it would leave me in a, in a clean, always clean white room, you know? Not lived in. Don't want lived in. I can't take lived in. I could take lived in when I was young. I can't do lived in now. I mean, look at this face. Lived in. Yeah. We're all bodies cracking up. Old bloody thing needs retiling. Make a note of that. Retile body. Oh, God. <laughs> Sometimes I think I'd just like to end it all. Oh, oh God, Abby. Do you know what you're saying? Yeah, well, it would be finished, you see, if builders had kept a bloody deadline. But they haven't painted the skirting boards. Some of the carpets haven't arrived. Oh, God. Well, where am I in all this, you know? Where's well, time for me to do what I want to do? Well, what do you want to do? <sighs> No, I'd like to paint, you know? Paint, paint, paint! Abby, I've painter. given you three paint sets. I gave you no, an easel. Paint, I, don't really I booked paint. you on a painting holiday really to paint. not painting! I don't want to paint. I can't paint. I hate painting. Painting is just a metaphor for time for me. 
You don't have this problem. You've got this brain that can just stand still. What? Stop it! Stop it! Stop that! God, why am I never allowed time to be a person in my own right? Jesus Christ! Do as you're told just once. I refuse to feel guilty about you. God, think about this. Think about it seriously, all of you. Oh, don't look at me like that just because you're some kind of psychologist. You think you I'm a psychiatrist, know what's happening you? in people's heads when you no, don't. No, no. All right. I'm saying is, why don't you let the kids out of the car and they can play on the grass? What kids? Why haven't you got the kids in the no, car? No, that's the dogs. <laughs> what? Boy, are they giving me a hard bloody time at the moment. I will take you for a walk when I've got a second, all right? <sighs> you know who I envy? The poor. No, I do. I mean, at least they have a simplicity enforced upon them. The more I have, the less time I have to do anything. Even breathe. Oh, God. I mean, I went to a gym and I moved for an hour this morning and I set an hour aside this afternoon for breathing, but oh, I quite like to move the breathing up. Actually, I don't think I can move the breathing up. I don't know. I haven't got time for it from this lunch, so I'd have to cancel the lunch. Can I cancel this lunch? Yes, please Thank cancel you. this lunch. Thank you. Cancelled lunch. Jesus. What? Christ. What? What the hell do you think you're doing, huh? Look at all this! Look at all this mess! Every bloody year it's the same, isn't it? Who's gonna clear it up? Oh, no, not you. Muggins here, that's who Muggins! Think! Have some thought! <laughs> Told him. Abby? Yeah? Can I talk to you seriously for a moment? Yeah, yeah, I'm I hurry. want you to come and see me professionally this week. Okay? I'm not insane. No, I didn't say you were insane. Is it what I said? I no, think that was it quite isn't reasonable. what you said, Abby. It's just that you're talking to a tree. Oh. <laughs> Alphabet forwards. A, B. C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, 2, O, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. <laughs> Alphabet backwards. Z. Z, Y. <laughs> Z, Y, X. Here. No, I'm not coming all the way over there. I've thought about it. If I go over there and back, over there and back, over there and back, for this whole tour, my knees are going to give out. I'm not coming over there, okay? Thank you. <laughs> well, let's just forget the sketch. Let's just, no, no let's hey, just not hey, do hey, it. Hey. Don't be unprofessional about it. I haven't just negligently not thought about how to get over there, have I? No, I've come up with a solution, thank you, as to how to get over there with the very littlest of effort. Okay. Well, do it! Right! <laughs> she walked. She walked. Sorry about this. Oh. Dawn. <clears throat> Back in a minute. Dawn. <laughs> Okay. 
Uh, just down. come here. So luckily I'm near a garage. Oh, excuse God. me, just a moment while I fill her up. Thanks. How long is this going to take? <laughs> there we go. God, she's a thirsty mother, this one. <laughs> Drinks like a bitch. Still, I didn't throw her around the camber like a oh. whore. <laughs> She'll drink 40 gallons in one slurp, then. High-grade octane for the lady. <laughs> she's a trollop and a tramp. That'll take a while. Oh, oh God, no, I meant to tell you while we're waiting. What? Um, you know, last Monday, mm -hmm. you know I told you I was going to go and visit my friend Rachel, who lives over the road from me? But yes. you know I have to go under the subway to get to her house? Yes. It was about quarter past three. I went under the subway. As I was coming up the other side, I saw this beautiful honey with a beautiful body. I asked him if he'd like to come in for a drink with me, which he did on the Tuesday. <laughs> the Wednesday? Thursday. <laughs> Friday and Saturday. What do you think we were doing? <laughs> Making love. <laughs> Obviously, I had to chill on the Sunday because I was exhausted. <laughs> Still drinking? Yes. So the following Monday, right? Couldn't believe this. I had to go and visit my friend Rachel. Do you know Rachel, who lives over the road from me? Yeah, yeah. You know, I have to go into the subway yeah, to get to yeah, her house. Yeah, yeah. It's about, oh, I don't know, quarter past three, something like that. Went under the subway. As I was coming out the other side, saw this beautiful honey. <laughs> really beautiful body. Asked him if he'd like to come for a drink with me. And he did. That was on the Tuesday. The Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Guess what we're doing? Making love! Obviously we had to chill on the Sunday because... Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> Boy, was he hot. And the following Monday, you'll never guess no, what happened. No, don't start again. I had to go and visit my Even twice isn't funny. Oh, fine. Will fine. you just come over here? Is the lady replete yet? No, still drinking. Oh, Do you want to trade while we're waiting? Trade what? Pokey Pokey. <laughs> Pokemon? Well, they're like Pokemon, but I got them in Amsterdam. Oh. <laughs> I know you've got some cards I want. My have. Okay. Ready? I'll give you my honey twam <laughs> for your chuff box. Has a honey twam got energy? Yeah, loads. No? Mm, okay, driving a hard bargain. I'll give you my honey twam and my love spuds. <laughs> and my winky bag. For your chuff box. Come on. I haven't got a chuff box. You have, I've seen it. <laughs> right, fine. I'll give you my joy knob and my chutney ferret. <laughs> for your shitty stick. <laughs> Come on! What does the shitty stick evolve into? A body bird. Oh, yeah, it's it's not about Pokemon. Pokey That's Pokey. not Pokemon. I'll give you my slang for your diddy squirt. No, no, no. no. My tickle faggot for your mutton gun. That's not no. Pokemon. Fine, fine. This is my final offer. This is a rare one. I'll give you my dangleberry <laughs> for your purple headed custard chucker. Oh, yeah. no, fine, That's fine. Not Don't Pokemon. trade then, you meanie. God, you missed out on a good one there. Yep, yeah, the lady is replete. And I am ready to come over there and do the rest of the sketch with you. Well, don't bother. Keep going. You're too what? late now. You're too late now. Keep going.
All right, welcome, welcome back. Um, there, you, there you are, there you are. Welcome back. It's 8.03 and coming up later, we've got some love... There you are. No, there you are. <laughs> got some lovely items. Coming up, we've got our virgin from Huddersfield who wants to have a baby. Um, we've got top stylist John Frieda is here to give her a cut that hopefully will do the trick. Oh, I'll cross fingers there for the virgin. Um, and 80... 808 to 810, we've got our in-depth look at the AIDS crisis in Africa, which is uh, <laughs> really nasty at the moment. So to take our minds off that a bit, we've got our poetry spot. There you are, poetry spot. And today our poem is sent in, I've got it here, is sent in by Jean of Bridgewater. Jean sent us a poem that she's written about things that make her really happy. So here it goes, I'll read it. <laughs> there, there you are, there you are. <laughs> you can, at the supermarket, find most things. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Apples and pears and donut rings. <laughs> I love that little rhyme that she's got there. <laughs> Sprinkle with sugar or spread with marge. They come in sizes, small, medium, and large. <laughs> oh, it seems to end there. That's lovely. Oh, oh I was really, I'm really filling up there, Jean. Thank you for that. Yeah, but now on a more happy and glamorous note, we're gonna go over to Hollywood now for our favorite bit of the show. Our Hollywood correspondent is there, Dawny Brambles, can you hear me? Dawny in Hollywood. Hello! Hi! Hi Dawny! Wow, what a week it's been Welcome. here in Give Hollywood. Us, I can't hear Give oh, us privy. You've... <laughs> what a week You've it's been. You've been privy to sorry. some of the um, glamorous occasions. All the people. Oh, sorry. Mm. Everybody. You've been privy to no, some no, of the glamorous. No <laughs> there is a satellite delay, for God's sake. I know that. Can you just wait? Get back you speak, the then I speak, then wait. Oh, okay? I've got a broad to do this. Yeah. Are you going to do the accent, by the way? How are you? <laughs> Go on, do the rain. Oh, Dawny. Dawny, welcome. Hi. Listen, tell us, you've been privy to some glamorous happenings, I believe, in Hollywood. Oh, yes. Um, I'm talking about a certain wedding, I think. Oh, I know what wedding you're referring to. It's a couple of weeks ago now, but it's still oh. the buzz of the town. Yeah. Do you mean Brad and Jennifer? <gasps> Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston. Yes. Oh, we love her. Oh, we really love lovely. her. We yeah. love them both. We love everything they've got. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Tell us a little bit, Dawny, about what she might say have been wearing, say, on her, say, wedding day. Well, this is a bit of a PMTV exclusive here, mm. because we happen to know she was wearing this. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, we can't be sure this is the exact style Ooh. of the dress she was wearing, oh, but we do know we this is the exact that. size. Oh, <laughs> yeah. lovely. 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 Yeah, yeah. lovely, yeah, lovely, yeah, uh, lovely. Dawny? Yes? Tell us a little bit about, say, what Jennifer Say might have, you know, say done on, say, the morning of her wedding. Yes, well, we're imagining, say, probably she Ooh. might have, say, got up. <gasps> um, and then maybe she would have brushed her very famous dreamy oh, locks, you know, yeah. in a very kind of oh. casual dreamy way, mm. making them look lovely. Mm. And then perhaps she would have had a light breakfast, <gasps> something maybe sushi, maybe grass, <gasps> juice, yeah. maybe a mixed leaf salad, something like that, <laughs> you know, for energy. And then maybe possibly some of her bridesmaids, her famous bridesmaids, oh. might have popped over to give her a little bit of support, do you think? Mm. Uh, people the likes of Callista Flocklart. Um, maybe Heather Clocklier, uh, maybe Claudia Schlifflier, uh, and Courtney Cox. <laughs> They'd have popped over, wouldn't they? And she'd have given them a little gift, wouldn't she? Like a little gold heart or something. You know, saying thanks so much from Brad and Jenny or something like that. And maybe some little almonds in a Dawny. little... Yes? Dawny? Yes? I believe you've had a busy week catching up with old friends. Oh, yes. Tell us about that. Oh, well, a very dear old friend of mine tracked me down and begged me to come over and have a gossipy chinwag with her. She wanted to talk about her dead dog. Oh. 
Uh, would you believe it? It's Liz Taylor. Oh, we love her. Go to the clip. We've got a clip. And we're um, so that all these dear, you dear really? people, can you get me closer? And who I think of as family, have given so very generously. Hang on. <coughs> Over here, uh, Miss Taylor, PMTV oh, from England. Oh, but have died. What's it like to be a Dane? Sorry. Excuse me. I'm so sorry. Such a lovely lady. Yeah, lovely. Oh, she's lovely. really lovely. Yeah. But, Dawny. Yes? Um, I believe you've been catching up with some Brits over there. What's that Brit pack? What's that all about? Do you know, I have. And the best Brit I've caught up with, this is a PMTV exclusive here. Ooh. Very good friend of mine. Tracked me down, begged me to come over for a gossipy chinwag. Oh. Would you believe it? It's the famous Hollywood scab, Liz Hurley. Oh. <laughs> oh. Miss Hurley, sorry, no, PMTV, really. over here, yeah, over here. So uh, what was your involvement with this movie? Um, I think I was like the, the uh, producer or something. Yeah. I had a pen. Yeah. Could you tell us a bit more about the on-off with Hugh Laurie? <sighs> Damn. Oh. <laughs> She's so <laughs> lovely. Really lovely, oh. yeah. And can I tell you, as a very close friend of hers, oh. I can tell you that she's even more beautiful on the inside of her body. Oh, oh lovely. <laughs> yeah. Dawny, I think that's... Oh, oh time no. for one more. Time for one good, more. Good, good. You've got another Brit you've oh, been talking to, I believe. This is a huge PMTV exclusive. Oh. Very dear friend of mine. Tracked me down, asked me to come over and got to be chinwag. <gasps> um, yeah, a bit of a surprising one, this one. Her first bit of acting, a yeah. leading role in the sequel to Gladiator. Would you believe it? It's Anne Widdicombe. May I say this emphatically that um, obviously a woman um, of my age is uh, marvellous to be offered. <laughs> <laughs> um, PMTV, could I um, <laughs> May I make it perfectly clear to you that I said I would not do any interview with you today. Please leave the room immediately. Now, please. It's nonsense. Such a shambles. Sorry. Please go. No. Um, rising crime. Um. <laughs> oh, is she lovely? Oh, she's lovely. So lovely, yeah. She's lovely. Yeah. Well, Dawny, thank you. Oh! Thank you. All right. That's all we've got. What? 30 seconds. Pardon? 30 seconds. OK.
Belinda's Wedding, part two. Thank you. Yes, Penny, I'm aware that Abby is half an hour late. But don't worry, people are often late for their first therapy session. They're afraid, you see. I mean, I haven't even heard from Vanessa Feltz yet, and she's bound to call. She can't go on like that. once and for all. These are your dogs. They're Those not your the kids. kids. No, these no, are your the dogs. Those They're are... not your... Come and look. Are... These are your... Well, those are your kids. Those are your kids. <laughs> but very often they're your dogs, aren't they? And we're going to sort that out later, Abby. Now then, Abby, you are half an hour late. And I'll pay for it. No, it's nothing to do with paying for it, Abby. It's just that by being late, you see, you're being very self-abusive, aren't you? Do you see? I mean, you're just actually hurting yourself. Completely. Um, it's not that I mind at all. It's not that I ow, mind. Ow, it's just that ow, you're being ow, ow, ow. horrible to yourself. We've got to sort this out, Abby. Well, I'm not staying. What? I'm no, you are staying. staying. You I'm are staying. <laughs> Come here. Ow. Sit ow. down and ow. have some therapy. <laughs> oh, you've had your roots done. There's something positive. <laughs> now, Abby, welcome to your first session of therapy. Don't be afraid. Nothing to be afraid of. Okay, here we go. Now then, obviously this is your first session, so by law I have to ask you a couple of questions. Don't worry, they're not at all intrusive. Here we go. How old are you, Abby? 42, thank you. <laughs> Do you have a history of mental illness? No, thank you. History of PMT? Yes, every cycle. <laughs> history O level? No. <laughs> Favourite colour blue? Shoe size five. Owl or lark? Sorry? Owl or lark? Come on, come on. Owl or lark? Owl or lark? What? Sorry, I don't Owl understand you. I, I don't understand you, so I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> well, please don't answer a question if you don't understand it. That's just silly. The question is perfectly straightforward. Yes. Are you an owl or are you a lark? <laughs> I'm here to tell you you're an owl. Okay. <laughs> right, we're going to start off the session, Abby with you talking to me a little bit about John. John. John, your husband, John. John. Fire um, away. Well, John's been great at the moment. He's, right. uh, he's helping a lot around the house. Yep. Um, coping with my stress very well. It's great with the kids. The kids uh, seem to love him. He's some kind of saint as far as they're concerned. He, uh, he got the big car I wanted, the bigger car, so I can get more stuff into it. Um, are you going to write all this down? Sorry? Are you going to write all this down? No, I'm just finishing a letter to my mum. <laughs> there we go. Love, morning. Kiss, kiss. Right, let's get started with the therapy, shall we? Uh, not miss a bad. Right, the most wonderful thing about therapy, Abby, is that I'm going to teach you to heal yourself with positive thought. Do you see? So, I would like you to talk positively now mm -hmm. about some aspect of your life. Well, at the moment, you no, see no, the whole no, point. No, no, no. Sit up, sit up. I can't sit up because my back is no, actually... No, sit gone. up, Abby. The other day Something I was positive. Lifting, Come on. So I'm, <coughs> I'm gone. Do you understand <coughs> what positive means? Yes, yes. Okay, yes, here we go. It's just that I'm here because no, there's nothing positive. I can't seem to see through. Something positive. positive. I can't seem to see just through. Just something positive. For God's sake, oh, it does. Oh, Jesus. Oh, stop it, stop it. Jesus Christ. Christ's sake, Jennifer. Every time you do this sketch, this is what you do. You're so instructive. No wonder we wrote this sketch. We based that character on you because you, you are a grumpy you old bitch. sow. You bitch. No, it's just a bloody bitch. You're schizophrenic. That's what you are. You I am not schizophrenic. She's showed you are schizophrenic. I am oh, so much for the old oh, the saucy scamp off the TV, the cheeky hey. chappy, the vicarity will be. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, that's not the truth. Are you really happy? I'm oh. perfectly happy, thank you. Oh, yeah. Sure Don't you project are. your jealousies onto me. Pathetic. Me like that. I don't know what you're looking at. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a knob on the head! What? What are they looking at? Oh, I know, 
people like you, you pay your money and you come to a place like this so you can look at some celebrities having an argument. Well, yes, let's well, have an argument. Let's Sit it down the papers. There's a load of wires on you, just peeping Tom. Love your ring. Come on. What? Love your ring. Do you? This one? Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous? Do you know what that means? What is that? Diamondique. Knew it. Oh, yeah. I knew that was Diamondique. Oh, yeah. And that one. It's Diamondique. It. Yeah? It's very like jewellery, oh, isn't it? Oh, God. That's yeah. fantastic. Got it from the home shopping. That fooled me. That fooled me. And you know that's antique eek as oh. well. Oh, <laughs> Isn't it gorgeous? Yay. Yeah. Really lovely. That's beautiful. I've got 50 pieces of Diamondique now. Have you? Yeah. Sometimes I don't even wear them, I just look at them in the box. Oh, yeah. oh hello, treasure. Hello, treasure. Hello. Come to get me dressed. Oh, Isn't she gorgeous, my treasure? Oh, yes. Sometimes I call her puppet. <laughs> Do you like the jacket? Yeah. Got yes, this off the home shopping. So this is my jacket. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's very like a jacket, isn't mm. it? It's lovely. Is that you my see my new treasure? hair? Yes. This is my hair eek. Oh, do stop <laughs> it. Stop, <laughs> stop it. it with your eeks. Sit. <laughs> oh, me? You would tell me, wouldn't you, Trash? Oh, God, I'm looking oh, forward to this not. hour of oh, selling. Oh, me too. Thank you, Treasure. I love my treasure. She's a bit too pretty, though. She may have to be killed. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> I tell you what. <laughs> tell you what, I'm feeling lucky. We are going to sell, sell, sell. Ooh, are we going to sell, oh, sell, yes. sell? This is going to be our lucky day. I've just been on the contraceptive hour. Oh, have you? Yes, they've got the Star Trek condoms in. Oh, have they? They go boldly where no man has been before. <laughs> Little Dutch cats shaped like the Enterprise. Oh, what are they doing in that? Do they get left? No. Did they get like hot cakes? Hot cakes. Oh, lovely. Here okay. we go. <laughs> <laughs> Counting in <clears throat> five, four, three, two, one. This hour, oh, we've we? been waiting for it, haven't hey, we? The French and Saunders collectible. Oh, Are we lucky? We're we've been, been waiting for the, ages. The rare tour mugs, I think, aren't yes, we? Yes, the rare session. tour mugs. They're, oh, oh, they're lovely. Oh, aren't they they're so beautiful. They're beautiful pieces. I love this Both one. Both individually oh. and big packs. They're lovely. Yes, because they're made of porcelain. Well, they're made of porcelain, I think. Yeah. That sounds like porcelain. That's the clay of kings. Oh, lovely. Can I do some dimensions? Do some dimensions on that one. Well, I point well to we've this got a one. 70 across the rim, we've got a 90 down. Yeah, that's oh. a very, I love a good rim. Oh, oh God. God. It's got a nice oh, bottom, God. good bottom. You've got to have a bottom, otherwise you scald your knees. I don't know, you, with the never, hot never drink through a tube. No, it's no, not good. no, it's not no. Good. no. What do you love about that? What do you, do you love know what I love about this? It's not a cup, is it? A cup is standoffish, isn't it? It's posh. But this is a mug. This is your oh. friend, isn't it? Something like this. This mug. We'll never, never run off with another woman, oh, for instance. Oh, God, it's got me going now. It'll never take the keys to the car and give it to the girlfriend. I should have brought a hanky. That mug will always love you. That's my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm going to buy them oh, all. They're gorgeous, oh, aren't oh, they? Oh, they're lovely, lovely. Really lovely. We're just coming yes. up to the interval, really. Yes, we are, they? yes. Oh. Now, the interval's approaching. You've got two hands, haven't you? Oh, they're four. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's, that's the additional that's the optional, feature. That's the optional the handle. feature. The handle there. <laughs> um... Now, you've got two hands, everyone. What are they for? Mm. One hand's for your beer, the other one's for your merchandise. Yeah, well, Don't forget that. And that. enjoy yourself. Oh, oh. oh. I China, that. Oh, okay. I love that. Have a lovely interval. Bloody hell, do I need a drink? I'm going to the bar. Why? That's it. All DIMCO personnel, please be seated. The conference is about to resume. All DIMCO personnel, please be seated. The conference is about to resume. Ladies and gentlemen, Fellow excellent seekers, prepare to own your future. Your life changes from this very moment. Unleash the power 
the power of you. We have got the power. Come on, everybody, we have got the power. Come on, clap your hands. Come on, you all. Come on. We have got the power. Come on, oh, we have got the power. Here she is. Come on, so everybody, ladies and gentlemen. Here she is. Woo! We have got the power. High five. Woo! personal officer and Sal here my techno whiz kid I want to welcome you to Dimco and Tech Inc's annual general sales conference here in the southwest <laughs> now then some of you may know I just come back from Seattle <laughs> home of the American mother company and I've had some retraining over there and boy, oh boy, am I exploding with motivation. <laughs> and I've come here today, folks, posse team, to pop, pop, pop some of that motivation into you. <laughs> now then. <laughs> Last year, some of us was a bit scared, weren't we? <laughs> when we was taken over by the big American mother company. But listen up, homeboys. We don't need to worry because there's big benefits in it for us, oh yes. Boy, oh boy, gee whiz, yes. <laughs> We're gonna get big cars, bum, bum! We're gonna get big money, bum, bum! And we're gonna get big other things like health insurance, bum, 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 bum! Yeah, all we gotta do, right? All we gotta do is put something back in. And you know what that is, folks? It's the big C, it's commitment. Go commitment, go commitment, go commitment. Right. Right. Mr. Chuck Winkleberger, that's our new boss over there. He's asked me to give you a message. He wants me to tell you that you are important, sales warriors, because only because of you is Dimco the number one company in North Devon. <laughs> Selling high-tech facility backup tech facility systems <laughs> this millennium. Go millennium! Go millennium! Go millennium! Right. <clears throat> Woo! Good. Right. <clears throat> hey, Derek. How comes you're so late? Yeah, well, we all had to negotiate the roadworks on the Oakhampton Bypass, Derek. I comes that way. I come through Dodd as well. It's got flood in there and I'm only in a mini. <laughs> yeah, well, find somewhere to sit, Derek. Move up to next to another sales warrior. Marjorie, move up. Let him sit there. Shape up, Derek, or get off the pot. <laughs> because this company is lean and mean and keen. 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 Right. Right. Here we go. <laughs> I'm going to do a little motivational trick on you now. See how it goes. Ooh is the most important person in the room. Me! Well, not me, obviously, you. Oh, God, you don't know how to do it, do you? <laughs> they don't know how to do it, Sal. There goes mad in America when you do that, there goes mad. Sal, will you help me do it? Yeah. Sal will show you how to do it. Now, here's what we do, right? <laughs> you all right, Sal? Right. <clears throat> now, listen up. All right, posse? Listen up. Here's how it goes, right? I say, who's the most important person in the room, right? And then you put your hands in the air like this. Top of your voices, lift the lid off this room. You shout, me! Got it, right? Here we go. <laughs> right. Ready? Who is the most important person in the room? in that place. <laughs> now then, let's take ownership of our power for the next 40 minutes as I take you on a life-changing journey outside the anxiety cubicle on a path to personal growth. Oh, that's lovely, Sal, thanks. <clears throat> as our new company motto states, 
Every journey starts with one step. So people, let's be giants. Let's take giant steps. Let's be heroes, not zeros. <laughs> stand strong, stand tall, and be truly connected here in the moment. Right. <clears throat> Can we examine the cash flow projections, please? These are our midterm investments. Uh, this is uh, incubating the expansion of outsourced products. It's got something to do with personal interaction zones. That's offices to you, Derek. And let's remember our key message, folks. Big heart, big mission. That's lovely, thank you. Now, let's remember homeboys and hoes. <laughs> in a real-time world. And what, and what, we, oh God, Sam, I've got a problem. The words ain't coming up on these things. It's not coming up, it's just stopped. Oh, I have it. Can you get it to move? Because I have to make it up otherwise. <laughs> what, what we, no, 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 I don't want it there. Not there, Sam, here. I need it here, okay? Let's not forget, know your goals. And, oh, that doesn't sound right, Sam. And as always, motivational gurus will tell you I'm making it up now Hi. Um, something to do with your own garden turning into weeds or something anyway <laughs> right. a bit earlier I was saying that Dimco company North Devon no I'm not doing that it's my mic well get it fixed Sal for Christ's sake come on now <clears throat> isn't it amazing and isn't it awesome that Dimco should, should make a product that means you can access, access your home computer system from New York to Zanzibar using a WAP system the size of a lipstick. <coughs> Sorry I keep saying systems, it's the only word I can think of that, that describes a system. Sort of system. It. What do you mean, reboot it? I've got to switch it off, hit it, and switch it on again. Hang on. <laughs> right. There you go. While Sally finds the relevant information, bear with me a while while I continue. <laughs> Personal ident. Lather to the suck fuck. Get it sorted. Get it sorted now. I'm looking like a chump. Oh, right. I'm going to continue on about personality drive for a moment. You might want to push back at me on this. Stop laughing, Derek. Christ's sakes. Now then. Um, oh, God. Um. <laughs> Excuse the building, I think. That's unprofessional. I'm sorry, oh, sorry about that. That's emergency right. procedure. Sorry about this, everyone. We'll get rid of this stuff. As you can tell, the whole bloody thing's crashed now. Um, it's probably best if you go out in the car park. Or if you're hungry, go over to the harvester, have a pie and a pint. <laughs> we'll be a voucher for that, obviously. While you're there, please remember to stay motivated, stay focused. And remember, this isn't who we are anymore. Now then, Sally's going to talk us out with a little inspirational thing. You got the power! You turn. Oh, sorry. sorry, sorry. Um. <laughs> um, my no uh, the nomination that I want to do this week is um, I want to nominate Dawn um, to leave the show because I really like her and it's not a personal thing because I think we all get on really well. Um, it's just that uh, when she first came in she was wearing a G-string and I know that that is the only G-string 
Um, she had and she hasn't taken it off, and now we can't <laughs> pass it. I don't know where it's gone. Um, but that's not the reason, because I think I really like her. Um, and she does sleep, she sleeps a lot, um, she smells quite a lot. But that is not, I mean, that's fine by me. It's just that I think she really misses her family a lot, and <laughs> she, she would really benefit from getting out, because I know that when she left, she'd only really just got on top of her geraniums, and I think she'd love to get back and see them, and that's why I want to nominate her. Um, my nomination is for Jennifer to leave the show. Um, it's a simple matter, really. Uh, she's in contravention of the rules um, because it quite clearly stated on the application form that you had to be human. <laughs> and I know for a fact that she isn't because I grew her from a crystal. <laughs> um, only two of my crystals took off. One was Jennifer in the end, and one turned into Grant Bovey. <laughs> um, the other thing I wanted to say is a request, really, please, um, which is, could you please, please turn off the cameras in the shower um, and in the toilet, <laughs> just for a minute? Um, I promise I won't do anything bad. It's just that I haven't been able to have a shower um, since I came in here because I don't want to show the public my norks or my growler. Um, <laughs> And so I really do need to have a shower, so if you could just turn them off for a second. And the other thing is, in the toilet, could you turn them off there? Because, um, obviously, as you know, I was a size six when I came in here, same size as Simon Minogue. And I haven't been able to have a poo. <laughs> so all of this now is just, I'm just full of poo. <laughs> I can have a huge, great big poo.
look, I know, I know we're not um, supposed to talk about this, but it's just about the nominations. I don't think it's really weird. I really want you to know that I have never nominated you because I like. I know, but she was almost to you. I don't know who was doing it. So, I thought it might be the chickens. I mean, I know who's nominated you. Do you? Yeah, because I shouldn't say this, but it's the audience. <laughs> well, when they came in this evening, the audience. Yeah. They all handed me a piece of paper with your name on it. No. Which is, I mean, I don't know, they're not supposed to have pens. <laughs> so the whole audience wants me out of the show? Yeah. I think so. I know we're not supposed to be talking about the nominations. But, listen, be honest with me. Did you vote me out? Did you? Expected at all. No. It doesn't look casualty. like a real casualty, no. does it? We haven't even got a bed here. Yes, yeah, you've got a bed through there. We've got yes. a bed in here. That's, That's ridiculous, silly. isn't it? As if we don't matter. We're the background action. Yes! <laughs> we're the reality here. Yes! That's Wouldn't be drama actors. without us. No, I mean, we're the canvas on which they paint, aren't we? Yes. <laughs> Do you think we can be seen? Well, there's absolutely no point if we're not seen. <laughs> no point in us at all. No, no. You're looking a bit peaky. <laughs> Have I given you a line? No, you are actually looking a bit peaky. Ah, it's just makeup, I think. Oh, it's yes, good. Yes, yes, I wet it down some time. Okay, everybody, going in five. Oh. Uh, Martin, can you open the back curtain so we oh. can see the background action? Oh, that's us. That's true. And Harry, yes. remember right. to close it on your way in. Right, yes. there we go. Good, you're right. going to be seen. Going in yes. five. Here remember we go. to look poorly. I am poorly. And um, action. Started. I want to go home. I'm not ill. But my dear, they told me you were hurt. It was a very serious fall. What were you doing up that precarious ladder to the attic? <laughs> oh, the earth was in that old box that was so important. <gasps> Don't speak. Tell me later. But I must tell you. It's my will. Oh, what? Not now. Save your breath. Don't speak. What was it in that box? My will. What? Oh, what? A will. Shh. <laughs> Thank you. When the doctor comes, please be discreet. There's no need to go into our personal. Doctor's coming, doctor's oh. coming. <laughs> oh. I hope it's Dr. Mike Barrett. I love oh, Dr. I know, Mike Barrett. I know. Oh, if he comes, him. I'm gonna get him in here to look at you yes. because you could be dying. I am dying. You are dying, aren't you? Yeah. Yes. You can be dying. Right. Oh. Mr. Oh. I'm going to have to ask you to leave unless you're family, I'm afraid. But uh, I'm her. Betty, no. Jude, stop it. I'm her. I'm her oh, ladies, please. Friend. Friend. Jude, please, I'm her. Cousin, companion. Well, what? Lot of what? Things, isn't she? For heaven's sake, it's been 20 years I'm her. Oh, what? 
Hello. 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 Uh, look, it's all the same to us. What does it mean? Here. I have the results of all the standard tests that we run. Hello. It's rather serious. Hello. I'm afraid you've got... Oh, Roger! Roger! Yes. Sorry! Cut! Is that a take? I don't know it was a take. Look, I've got a script in my hand, isn't this? Oh, come on, I'd never tell a woman she's got Parkinson's disease with a cup of coffee in my hand. Roger, are you right? <laughs> Just come out with this. There's nothing to be ashamed of these days. Darling, you're not cutting me off enough. Well, darling, I was distracted, darling. Yes. Patrick, those extras are rather loud. Uh, supporting artist, please, if you don't mind, thank you. Oh, my God. I'm afraid. This curtain really be here? Just ask the doctor. Where is he? Oh, there you are. <laughs> You're a long way up, aren't you? What's the weather like out there? Let's ask you, Dr. Mike Barrett, should that curtain be there? I mean, after all, wouldn't you come in to see us first? Wouldn't you? Look, I can only really say what's in the script, I'm afraid. Yes, yes, but, Doctor. How is uh, Kenya? Kenya? Yes, I meant to ask you about Kenya. Because my son's going on holiday there, you see. Mm. And we were wondering, should he pack his own blood? Yeah. I mean, it's <laughs> Doctor, Doctor, I've got a little problem down here. <gasps> no, I'm not a doctor. <laughs> doctor, Doctor. No, I'm not a doctor. No. <laughs> but doctor, no, 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 no. Stop embarrassing him. She's carrying a little bit of a candle for you, Doctor Mike. <laughs> <laughs> so, Doctor, sorry, Mike. <laughs> Can I just say, you are the British George Looney. <laughs> Has anyone ever said that to you? I, I'm really terribly flattered. Uh, Do you mind if I just go and powder my... Uh... No, no, no. <laughs> oh. Hello. Oh. Hello. Conjunctivitis. <laughs> Visitor. <laughs> but hoping to develop complications later. <laughs> so good, that scene. Smashing. Smashing scene. Yeah. Are you actresses at all? So are we clear about those cues, Puppet? Well, I'm clear. Well, can I have a look at the script, please? Oh, 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 oh. we know that grumpy one in the bed. No, do yes, we? we do, we do. No. So, she's acting royalty, that one. Is she? Oh, yes, yes. No. She's from that great family of acting dinosaurs, isn't she? Oh, oh, the, 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 the red graves. Red graves. <laughs> No. No. Is it? Is it? I've never seen a red grave. Not a live one. Wouldn't know a red grave if it bit my bottom. No. <laughs> Give me something to write That's on. I'm going to ask her. Oh, God. Yeah. Have you got anything in your bag? I haven't got that. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, can't. I can't take that, can I? Where's that her tampon? No. I mean, she'd rather have that, wouldn't she? Go no, take... she won't mind. She, she won't, won't mind. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Please graciously, would you do me the honour of inscribing your own monogram on my humble napkin here for all posteriority? What? Autographed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh. Oh. None the wiser. <laughs> Cossack, is it? Strange, isn't it? Cossack. Cossack. Oh, co oh, co oh, Cossack. What? Yes, they're the Irish uh, red graves, aren't they? The no. Irish. No. Oh! Oh, yes! Oh, so. yes. Okay. It's all the sisters, isn't it? Yes, yes, yes. And they've yes. all got very complicated oh. Irish names, haven't they? Well, well, oh, yes. Now, the eldest one is definitely called Knees. Knees. Yes. 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 There's one called Iron. Iron. Oh, Porker. Is she one? <laughs> Dorker. Orca. Rings she a one? bell. I don't Rings know. Oh, oh, this so Cossack. Yeah. Is, she's the one that's married to my left foot, isn't she? Oh. <laughs> she's so dim sometimes. Yeah. Of course she is. You know who she's married to? Yeah. She's married to Simba the Lion Cub. Isn't she? <laughs> yes. Oh, she's one of our most marvellous, magnificent oh, actresses, right. this yeah. one. That's why you're a bit confused. Yeah. She doesn't do a lot of telly. I've never seen no, her. No, she does no, she big, does. big stuff like... Shakespeare, Shakespeare, doesn't she? <laughs> oh, 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 you know what she was in? What's oh, that? what's that big 
Greek tragedy called... Oh, Demis Roussos. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, the one where you have to eat your own son. Um, oh, yeah. Oedipus, is Oedipus. it? Is it? Oedipus. Is it? Oedipus. And then the sun flies up to the moon, doesn't he, and his wings melt or something. When was this? Well, oh, God, she played the mother, come on. Um, clitoris or something. <laughs> Big women's parts. Oh, she, <laughs> <laughs> she does. No, she doesn't hear that. I think we should tell her. I'm going to go and Do tell her. I'm going to tell her. Shall we tell her I've seen her? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to tell her I've seen her. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, we did know it was you, actually. Actually, my daughter, I think, has seen you. Um, she did a school trip to Bradford and Avon, the birthplace of the Great Board. You'll recognise it. If music be the moody food of love, play on, Macduff. Huh? And may I say to you, I'm sorry, may I say, huh? age cannot wither your stale and infinite variety. <laughs> <laughs> Miss, um, Miss, or is it Dame yeah. Shinoriad Cossack? <laughs> <laughs> you know what you've been in, don't you? Mm-hmm. You're probably two of our biggest fans. You know what you've been in. Oh, Christ. We are trying to rehearse. Yes, oh, yes, we know that. I'll tell you what you are. I'll tell you exactly what you are. You're what the British do best. We should bottle you up and sell you. On aeroplanes. Yes. Yes. Do please piss off. We're trying to learn our bloody lines, and you are not helping. Well done. (laughs) (laughs) What a load of bollocks this is. All Marjorie's fault. He friggin' cocked it up. Oh, she looked at us then. See your latest agent. Oh, you'd get her. Well. Yeah. <laughs> I take husband and I even take Nathan. Everyone's right. What do I copy get? Oh! Some boring bitch. She's falling off a ladder. Oh, she should be grateful for any work, I think. Cocking twat. It's a ballsy cocking fuck up. Oh. You must have said yes. I know, but what a load of cocking twat. I wanted to be the next Brenda cocking fricker. <laughs> the damn stupid witch's scrotum. Oh, it's really unnecessary. It's really unnecessary, all that effy effy. Oh, a bunch of wankers. Oh! <laughs> oh! Right, everybody, that's tea. Back in five. Oh, sorry. Oh, dear. Oh! I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, I'm no. sorry, I don't think that's necessary no. at all. Effie, 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 effie. Yes. <laughs> I'm very glad my son wasn't here to hear that. <laughs> I'm very glad my son wasn't here to hear that. Yes. Well, you haven't got a son. No. <laughs> I'm very glad he wasn't here to hear that. You see, that's why actresses like this never get to do films in Hollywood. I know. And wasn't I saying the other day? Wasn't I just saying? Why on earth don't they use great British actresses of ours in big Hollywood films like... Like Mrs Doubtfire. Like Mrs says. Doubtfire. Yeah. Do you know, why did Robbie Williams do that I part? Don't know. Why didn't they use a woman? <laughs> well, there's your answer with all that effie, effie, effie. Yes. And in front of Dr Mike Barrett. Yes. Who's only just back from Kenya after saving thousands of lives. I know. <laughs> do you want a cup of tea? Yeah. I've got one here in my props basket under my dead baby. Yeah. Oh. That's my, you know, my oh, dead baby. Dead baby. Yeah. I use it in reception sometimes. Yes. Always gets me a close up. Yes. Always oh. cause a bit of a kerfuffle with that. Okay, here we go again. We're going oh. just from the doctor's entrance. Baby. Right. I think we'll keep the curtain closed this oh. time, okay? Curtain closed? Thank you, ladies. No, no, you won't see us. Right. We won't be no. seeing no. the curtains closed. Oh, that's just silly. What's the point in us? You've paid for us. Not. Oh. I'm not having that. I'm not having that. I'm, I'm not, not having, having that. that. I'm not having that yeah. either. Yes. Here we go. Good taste of my medicine. Action. Right. Mrs. O'Brien, now. I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask you to leave unless you're family. But I'm. Betty, no. Jude, stop it. I'm her friend. Please, ladies. Jude, please. I'm a companion. Oh, for heaven's sake, it's been 20 years. I'm her love. It's all the same to us here. Look, we have the results back of all the standard tests that we run. It's rather serious. I'm afraid you... Oh! Oh! Doctor! Doctor Mike Barrett! Look at my friend! She's fibrillating! Oh, it's a huge emergency! Please see to my dead baby. Stand back, Doctor! I don't know what to do!
Welcome to LOA. You've got post. You had no idea it was going to happen? None. I promise you, I swear. You know this is my husband we're talking about. I know that. It just happened. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just opened my mouth a little bit. He put his cock into it, and then you walked in the room. Okay? But you had no idea it was going to happen? None! I promise you, for God's sake, Julia. I am your sister. I know, I know, I believe you, I believe God. you, I believe you. I'm going to order. Okay. Hi. I'll have the cranberry bean and sunchoke compote with the roasted butternut squash thyme broth, the ginger lamb reduction and the sweet potato hay. You? I'm happy with a muffin. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty angry with George. He says it was a mistake, a misunderstanding, but how likely is that? Though, you know, I suppose stranger things have happened. Well, that's for sure. Yeah. Like that time I found you both naked in bed looking for his contact lens? <laughs> he had his finger up your ass? <laughs> At least he found it. <laughs> was it up your ass? Um, I think so, oh. yeah. It was, yeah. Yeah. He really is an idiot. I think sometimes he'd lose his head if it wasn't actually attached to his body. Yeah, I know. I mean, that other time. Oh, God, uh -huh. don't. 
Don't. When he lost his computer. <sighs> and he was looking for it, I think, when I came in the room. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where did he eventually find it? <laughs> um, <clears throat> in his office, I think. Yeah. Mm. Not in your vagina. <laughs> no. 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 Probably worth looking, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's thorough. He's thorough. He certainly is. Huh. Weird things always seem to happen when George is around. Yeah, I can't deny that. Mm. Remember when you were rehearsing the play? Oh, God, the play. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, was I furious when that was canceled. Yeah. Just canceled. Huh. <laughs> what was it about again? Um, God, um, bestiality. Bestiality in <laughs> rural Italy. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And you were playing? I was playing the donkey. Uh -huh. <laughs> and he was playing the schoolboy having sex with the donkey? Yeah. 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 Well, that was the little scene we were rehearsing when you came in. Oh, it wasn't yeah. all like that. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Hmm. That was so weird. It just got canceled like that. So My weird. God, all that work and then they canceled. <laughs> yeah. Huh. How's work? Oh, it's good. Yeah, yeah real good. Yeah. Okay. The food has improved here, I think. I think so. Mm -hmm. My muffin is delicious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, I gotta go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. um, it's through there. Uh, where? Through, through there. This is not the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> it's a weird place. Yeah. <laughs> through here? Uh -huh. I think I'm being really dumb. Can I change my order? <laughs> can, I, I, can I have the egg cumin, lemon gremolata, the wasabi potatoes, and the light calvados juice? Oh my God, can Jen. I, Jen, this is, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry about this, everybody. I'm really sorry. I wouldn't normally, I know we haven't finished this sketch yet, but I've, something I've absolutely got to tell you, something amazing has just happened. What? There's a phone call for you, you've got to take this. There is a phone call for you from but Tony I'm, I'm... Blair. Oh, you're kidding yeah. me, you're kidding me. No, I'm not. I can't take no. a phone call, I'm on Tony stage. Blair is on the stage. phone for you. And you know what day this is? Well, okay. she just told me it's um, the New Year's Honours list thing. Oh, you're kidding. And no, Tony so, Blair oh, is on the phone for you. You, you, having, so you having deserve me on? this, you babe. Me on? You deserve this. Are you having me on? No, I'm not. Tony Blair is on the phone. Hurry up. God's sake. Push my big number next. I I'm so proud of you. Do you mind if I take this it? This is so fantastic. Do you mind if I take the <laughs> <laughs> Can I leave you with all yes, that mess? Just don't worry about this. I'll do all this. I'll cover for you. You sure? Yeah, go on. You Sorry thing. about this. Where's the phone? Which phone? It's in the bus station. <laughs> You'll see it, yeah, it's still hanging down where I've just answered it. Quick! It's raining, put oh, your raincoat on. Okay. You deserve this, you talented thing. <laughs> She's gone. Right, get rid of this pretentious crap. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Come on, guys. She's gone. Right. This out, this out. Quick, 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 quick. She's definitely gone. Yeah, okay.
dare move. I'm going to come round, all right? Oh, right. <laughs> there was no phone box at the bus station. Right, sorry. Oh, she's really mad. Shit. Oh! I'm not you. How do you think you're going to get away with it, huh? Uncle. It's pathetic! What is it? It's pathetic. Pathetic! What do I fall for it? I can't believe it. Go into all this. I hate all this. I've got to go right to the last number now. You've got time for my bit. You've deprived the ladies and gentlemen of two minutes of the finest entertainment they might ever have seen in their lives, but don't worry about that. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Give me a chance! Get your mark. One word at the end of every verse, you know? Yeah. What it is? What is it? Downtown. 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 <laughs> yeah. I love you. Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> you know, I'm looking forward. I can see you. Downtown. Right. making you lonely you can always go <laughs> you got worries all the noise and the hurry seems to help but i know downtown 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 downtown, downtown. 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 Oh, no, I know. it's coming up again in a minute right, right how can you lose the lights are much brighter there You can forget all your troubles Forget all your cares and go something give me that give me that remote control stay there watch this just watch this and learn watch this oh, oh, oh wow Noise and the 
boys and I'm joking, you can help I know. Thank <laughs> you.